girlfriends welcome back to the channel for another video this week if you're new here my name is Jerenica Mycia but all my friends call me G and if you are a returning subscriber thanks for coming back this week and clicking on my face girl if you haven't already go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up like share comment subscribe make sure to follow me over on Instagram girl for all of the fabulous updates and come back each week for weekly uploads so today's video I'm gonna be sharing just five five summer fashion tips that will help you look effortlessly fashionable in two minutes now if we're being honest these are the tips that I've been using to get dressed and usually when I find tips like when I'm getting dressed and they're actually effective and they're working for me I like to share them with you guys now these tips are just like easy ways to kind of like look put together when you're going out the door right now it is a little hot outside it's muggy it's raining the weather is just all over the place so it is the perfect time to kind of like figure out little ways to look put together without trying too hard so if you are interested in this video girl just keep watching all right so i actually have a few pieces here that i would like to share with you guys that was gifted to me from nordstrom's this video is sponsored by nordstrom's so thanks so much to nordstrom's for sponsoring this video now what i love about nordstrom's shopping at nordstrom's you get like the best of both worlds they have um something for all ages they have um high and lows you can mix and it's just like that one-stop shop when it comes to shopping nordstrom's is definitely a place that anytime i'm looking for summer fashions i always go to nordstrom's first girl so if you don't know Nordstrom's actually just launched the closer to you promise and the closer to you promise is basically a way for Nordstrom's to offer top tier customer service and connect with their customer and the community I feel like this right here is going to be a game changer because let me tell you something when I saw that they will be offering tailoring services in all Nordstrom's like what are you uh what y'all know how i feel about altering my clothes like i'm here for it okay also gonna offer access to personal stylists they're gonna offer easier and more convenient shipping deliveries exchanges returns they're just making the shopping process for their customers so much smoother and easier another thing that actually caught my eyes besides the tailoring service was the opportunity to shop in store and online through a trunk service and they're also going to be offering um online digital styling assistance and i thought this was right here this this is like perfect they're literally doing all of the things that we need when it comes to um shopping in these stores and stuff like that so like i said earlier anytime i need to shop for anything no matter the occasion i always stop to nordstrom's and right now i'm going to be more excited to shop at nordstrom's just to see um the different things that they're going to be offering through the closer to you promise so, so i also have a few items here just a few that i would like to show you guys i feel like these will be perfect for um adding to your summer wardrobe they're minimal not too many but they will be very effective all right, so let's just hop right into this. And as we get into the tips, I'll uh, show you guys the products. Now, the first tip I have is add a low top sneaker into your summer collection or summer wardrobe rotation. I have been living in a pair of low top sneakers, y'all. I'm loving them with a few anklets. I say a few because I like to wear at least two anklets on um, each ankle. It just gives you summer vibes. I'm loving a good pair of low top sneakers. And I actually have two that I want to share with you guys. So the first pair I have are the these white um, sneakers let me oh, you should be seeing them on the screen um, me trying them on I actually have these white sneakers so cute so clean just chic and timeless now this is a sneaker I feel like I can wear I can wear it with dresses I can wear it with shorts I can dress it up I can wear it dress it down I can wear what I have on now like jump shoes jump shoots jump suits you can wear with cargos this is just a timeless sneaker the brand is um sam edelman it's probably one of my favorite shoe brands i feel like they give you um high designer quality but their price points are amazing but at nordstrom's i love the fact that they always have a good sale okay i also said a low top sneaker because one i'm not a high top sneaker girl i feel like if you're short it definitely cuts off your leg and with high top sneakers i can't wear ankles and it's summertime you need ankles on your ankle at all times okay so, so the low top sneaker I love the fact that I'm able to wear a sneaker but also have anklets and just feel a little more summery now with this sneaker I would recommend getting your regular size this sneaker I picked it up in a nine the brand Sam Sam Edelman they do run true to size so I would never uh, suggest sizing up or down with these sneakers they're super super comfortable so this is a sneaker that if you're traveling you know a lot of people are about to be traveling this summer this is a good sneaker to just throw in the um suitcase and just put on with almost anything be comfortable travel you can wear them to the airport they're easy to slip on and off and it's just a good timeless sneaker now the next pair that I picked up y'all I've been living in these I love these so much that I had to go back and purchase these in gold and the they're these low top silver metallic sneakers you should be seeing me try this uh, sneaker on 
These are my favorite sneakers. When I tell you guys, I'm actually wearing them with this uh, jumpsuit situation. Like, how how dope, right? Y'all, I love them. They look so cute on me. Now, with me, like I always say, with sneakers, I'm very picky because I'm short. I'm 5'2", so I do not like to wear things that cut my leg off. I also find with these sneakers, they're just easy. They, they I don't have to worry about it, and they're silver. Now, what I like about the silver, the silver can be like a neutral in my uh, wardrobe. So I was like, wait. This is going with a little too many things. I wore it with a dress to brunch. I wore it with a mini skirt with some anklets, which was chef's kiss. This is just a good sneaker that, like I said, I had to go back and get it in um, gold. With this sneaker, I did pick it up in a size nine, and this is also by the brand Sam Edelman. Like I said, y'all, this is a great brand to try out, especially right now. I love their boots in the um, fall, winter, but the spring, summer shoes right now, fire okay so these are super comfortable easy and effortless like i said i've been living in these that i had to run back and get um the other color okay so moving into tip number two you guys always hear me talking about barely their sandals i'm always telling you guys to invest in your good barely their sandal and when i say invest that does not mean the shoe has to be super expensive that just means you need to be more focused on getting a barely their sandal in your collection that is timeless that is comfortable that you're actually going to reach for and that can be versatile in your closet and you can wear it with multiple things one thing that i'm obsessed with right now is of course a barely their sandal but not just any barely their sandal i am obsessed with metallic barely their sandals and the next pair y'all i cannot try it on but i'm about to show you i actually can't try these on because i did hurt myself this week at the gym and i cannot wear anything that's gonna arch my foot so that's so unfortunate you guys should be seeing it on the screen just to get a better view of the shoe this shoe guys when i was able to try it on this shoe is so comfortable now with barely their sandals most barely their sandals have just one strap in the front let me put ugh, put it down let's come close well, it's trying to focus on my face okay see how most barely their sandals they usually have one strap this shoe actually has two straps and what i find is that second strap gives you support the shoe has padding on the soles and i just love it i think the thing that made me really love this shoe is it looks super high but it's not so it, it's not a kitten heel it's not too high it's not too low because i'm at the point right now y'all with shoes i've been cleaning out my closet and i've been looking for a nice barely there sandals because i realized when i was cleaning out my i guess shoe closet i was realizing i don't have that many um barely there sandals and the ones that I do have it's time to get rid of them because they're not comfortable I'm in my comfortable girl era I want to be comfortable but I do not want to sacrifice the quality of the shoe or looking fashionable so this right here I actually want them in a multiple colors and this is also another piece that i had to when i was like walking around like hold on this shoe is comfortable i believe the heel is four inches love that for us I went back and I got it in the sea green. The sea green is so beautiful, okay? The, and these shoes, y'all know how I feel about white toes. Amazing with a pair of white toes. So I would highly recommend this shoe. This is more of like a purple metallic snakeskin embossed pinkish purple. It's just fun. And right now in the summertime, what I was realizing, when I get dressed, let's say if I have on a white nice baby doll dress, because in the summertime, y'all, I love putting on baby doll dresses add your accessories is going to be your best friend so right now a barely there sandal that is giving me height in the heel but comfort in the arch we need her okay and add a cute little bag some sunglasses and you don't even have to do too much like it's too hot to be trying too hard okay we need ease and comfort and i promise y'all she's that girl she's that girl she's comfortable and she looks so pretty on so tip number two i'm definitely going to say add you a nice metallic barely there sandal in your collection you will not regret it okay so before we move on to tip number three those were all of the shoes that i uh, was gifted from nordstrom so all of these will be linked down below in the description box if you're interested in anything i'm also going to link a few of my recommendations down because girl i have a few okay because let me, i keep telling y'all the brand sam edelman it is just good okay so thanks once again to nordstrom for sponsoring this video and let's just hop right 
right into tip number three. Okay, so tip number three, I have layering pieces. Now, layering pieces in the summertime can be a little tricky because one, well for me, I'm gonna say a little tricky. One, it's hot outside, it's humid. I don't wanna feel like I have on a lot of different pieces. So I'm very particular. Now when I say layering pieces, right now is the perfect time to go with a statement belt around the waist. Like if you have on just a regular t-shirt, you have on a dress, put on a statement belt um, around the waist and add a little more zhuzh to the look. This is the time to focus on your kimonos and your dusters. Of course, you want lightweight pieces. I find when I'm getting dressed and I just want to be simple and I want to add like a little zhuzh to it, when I put on that third layering piece, it's just like the finishing piece, girl. I don't have to do too much, put on a pair of sunglasses and I'm out the door. Now, like I said, a layering piece in the summertime for me is of course a belt, um, kimonos, dusters, robes, but Lately, I've been, honestly, I've never thought about jewelry being a statement piece, but lately y'all, jewelry, statement jewelry has literally been saving my life with looks. When I say statement jewelry, I'm talking about like a good pair of chunky earrings that may have like a lot of detailing or I can wear like a nice choker that's very detailed and like in your face. Um, a, a cuff statement jewelry will literally set a look off without you having to worry without you having to try too hard just put on a few pieces and you out the door so definitely say focus on a few of your favorite layering pieces because girl they will come in handy okay just imagine having on a, a look you may have on a white tank top with some cargo pants and you're like oh it's cute but when you add that layering piece maybe like a nice kimono that fits the vibe or a nice chunky necklace or a nice pair of earrings something that's going to vamp it up a little you just took a look from a five to a ten within two minutes just literally on your way out the door so layering pieces right now they're saving me so tip number four is fashionable beauty now when i say fashionable beauty i mean this is the perfect time for you to play with colored eyeshadow and eyeliner and the thing that has me in a chokehold y'all it is going to be a uh, summertime nail designs like i'm obsessed with nails like when it comes to nail design, I y'all know I'm usually an all white girl, but lately I've been stepping out and just trying all of these fun colors. And I honestly find when I'm getting dressed, it adds a little zhuzh to my look versus me having like my white um gel manicure and those nail designs. It just makes me feel a little more fashionable and a little more um. I'm definitely gonna say to add a little spice and zhuzh to your summer fashions, don't sleep on the beauty area. Look at your beauty area and see how can you zhuzh it up and revamp it. Just giving a little color here. One thing I've been obsessed with lately is blush. I've always been a blush girl, but let me tell y'all, orange blush literally has me in the tightest chokehold that I never want to be let out of because orange blush is so pretty. But right now with the summer glow and you just want to look vibrant, it just adds this beautiful flush of color to your face. Do not sleep on blush and please do not sleep on orange blush because she is that girl. So definitely add a little more zhuzh to your um, beauty and I promise you'll see a difference, especially when getting dressed. When your makeup is bomb, you just really want to go all out with your outfit, you know? So tip number five is going to be add a few fun hats and scarves when it comes to getting dressed in the summertime a hat and a scarf girl like if you are not wearing hats and scarves what are you doing especially bucket hats bucket hats have have your girl right now also in the chokehold but this is the time that i thrive with scarves because scarves is just the way to go it's hot outside i don't feel like straightening my hair i don't feel like curling my hair today Add a scarf and you look so put together without trying. Add a, a pair of sunglasses on and you're out the door. Scarves and hats are so fun and just a, it can also be a layering piece, a third piece because it just ties everything together. So right now I'm going to definitely say add you a fun scarf, add you some hats and just try it out. Even if you're not a hat girl, that's why I say hats and scarves because a lot of people feel like they don't like hats. Scarves is for everybody. I personally invest more in scarves because with scarves, I don't just wear them on my head. I wear them as tops. You can wear it as like a bandeau top. And when I'm going to the beach, I always wear them as cover-ups around on my waist when I'm like just walking around. So scarves is something I would definitely recommend trying out if you want to get into like the hat scarf trend or I don't even know if it's a trend, but it's a thing. Thing, okay all right girlfriends so that was my five summer fashion tips that will help you look effortlessly fashionable in two minutes on your way out the door hopefully you guys take something from this you enjoyed the video if you did go ahead give this video a big thumbs up and i'll see you girls in the next one